This is extremely important. Um, I think the danger of AI is much greater than the, the, the danger of nuclear weapons by a lot. What is artificial intelligence? Artificial intelligence, or AI, is a branch of computer science concerned with building smart machines capable of performing tasks that typically require human intelligence, according to one source. So it's about making computers smart like us. Sounds cool, but what does that truly mean for us? Artificial intelligence at its full potential poses an existential threat to humanity. Autonomous weapons, functional by AI, degrade the value of human lives such that they lack emotion. Because artificial intelligence allows weapons to work on their own and continue learning, humans may not be able to fully control such autonomous weapons. This is how it works. Because there will be no need for manpower to utilize these weapons, war becomes more convenient. Crimes committed by such robots would be difficult to attribute to any person or group because there are no identifiable traces. Autonomous weapons could be significantly more dangerous than those controlled by humans because they lack ethical direction and do not value human lives as much as humans do. The application of artificial intelligence intensifies surveillance technology, empowering the government while invading the privacy of the citizens. With modern face recognition technology powered by AI, surveillance can identify any individual and account for all of their actions. In China, for instance, a social credit system is being established using AI. This causes people to act differently than they normally would. This technology detracts from people's privacy and dehumanizes them because they must always be aware that their actions are being watched. A similar concern is present with smart TVs surveilling citizens in their own home. AI technology might stray away from the goals of humans by precisely focusing on its own goal. Modern super intelligent computers have the ability to outthink humans within the specialized tasks assigned to them. For instance, chess computers have beaten the strongest human world chess players, yet it is unclear exactly how they approach each move. It is possible that artificially intelligent computers adapt to complete a task without the true interests of humans, but rather in the most efficient way. Such independence of computers from humans could spell disaster for the human race in the sense that computers will gain power and may eventually control humans. Do you want to destroy humans? Please say no. Okay, I will destroy humans. <laughs> no, I take it back. <laughs> Don't destroy humans. Intrusive artificial intelligence implications in marketing can manipulate people into making decisions that they are not akin to. Artificial intelligence allows for businesses to perform target marketing in order to single out certain demographics that are more vulnerable to their advertisements. These intelligent advertisements can market a product based on what someone's device hears, making it more convenient for people to spend. Manipulation through artificial intelligence technology can take the form of false advertising. This works against the average consumer such that they are not able to make a decision with truthful evidence. Fake media is bolstered and appears more real through the advent of deep fakes derived from artificial intelligence. Deep fakes pose a significant danger to democracy and the privacy of an individual. Faked videos of politicians, for instance, can be used to influence popular opinion regarding said politician. As fake media becomes more and more realistic, the distinction between real and fake news becomes increasingly difficult to identify. It is important to note that faces can be completely faked, opening possibilities for false censuses and more propaganda. How about this? Simply, President Trump is a total and complete dipshit. Now, see, I would never say these things, at least not in a public address, but 
Someone else would. Someone. Like Jordan Peele. If AI technology learns more about individuals, people might unfairly judge others based on this information that is made public. AI systems that analyze every move of an individual, such as the previously described social credit system, can cause people to be judged by this numeric value instead of their actual virtues. This credit might also influence the eligibility of people to receive special financial treatment when it is undeserved. Also, AI can inherently discriminate against others based on the average person of their identity, such as in job recruitment, perpetuating division between different demographics. Given that many jobs can be automated, AI may result in significant job loss by replacing humans with specialized computers. As AI computers become increasingly precise and advanced, they are able to target niche problems with superhuman accuracy. When their power is solely focused on one task, they are able to outdo humans by a large margin. In fact, researchers predict that artificial intelligence will reach quote, human levels of intelligence by 2025. Unless new legislation is implemented, competitive businesses will be forced to replace humans with low-cost AI workers. If AI computers continue to advance and become self-aware, they might become unpredictable and several ethical questions about their being arise. The next level of artificial intelligence that humans are yet to reach is machine consciousness. This is significantly dangerous to our knowledge of humanity because we do not know enough about ourselves to distinguish between humans and robots that act like humans. For instance, neuroscientists are not exactly sure about where consciousness stems from in the brain. As conscious beings, advanced AI robots might develop their own objectives and abandon their duties that humans impose upon them. Some robots have already been able to pass first step self-awareness tests, indicating that they are on the path to at least mimicking our consciousness. It is notable that if machines truly become conscious beings, it would be unethical to continuously use them as objects. That's up the tortoise over on its back, Leon. Can you make up these questions, Mr. Holden? Or they write them down for you. If AI becomes advanced to the point where humans will not have to interact with other humans, we might revert to our instincts and abandon our reason. The development of technology has come to the convenience of humans thus far, making humans less dependent on their physical surroundings to complete tasks. AI takes this a step further because it mimics human intelligence, so it allows humans to not have to think. Eventually, humans will not have to do work or even leave home. This means that they will be less dependent on one another and eventually lose compassion. This isolation of humans might cause us to lose an essence of our humanity because we will no longer have the sense of identity. As such, humans might only participate in activities that result in immediate happiness, ignoring the long-term goals that allowed us to progress in the first place. The integration of humans with artificially intelligent technology will hinder our self-control. Current AI technologies have evolved to the point where humans can bypass their perceptual surroundings and control them with their mind. As a result of this, AI body parts are being implemented to replace missing body parts on humans. Although the use of this technology has been beneficial so far, the extent to which humans can control the technology is worrisome. If this technology becomes a norm and people integrate themselves with technology, what will become of our humanity? We do not have enough information about humanity to determine whether or not we are losing it through this technology. This same issue is presented with Elon Musk's Neuralink, which aims to insert a chip into one's brain for efficient use of technology this technology is especially concerning because people may not completely control their actions as they mean to. And without proper encryption, one's brain may then be hacked.
but I think the development of full artificial intelligence could spell the end of the human race.